This video is sponsored by Motion VFX and the like button. For those who are not familiar with Motion VFX, they supply both plugins and temp templates for Final Cut Pro and DaVinci Resolve. And in my case, we're going to focus on plugins. So the one that we are going to focus mainly is going to be a M Fitness. So we are currently in Final Cut Pro. These are stock footage, so these are not my footage. So shout out to um, Tim Miroshiki. So all credit goes to him um, for creating these stock footage. I'll also leave a link in the description if you want to um, interested in grabbing a stock footage. So basically, um, I've edited this and um, I've compounded the, the video. So without me um, going in detail how I did it, everything is um, within this plugin itself. It's called M-Motion. So as soon as you download M-Motion, you will see it in your title plate here. You would have all of the plugins that you have. So in my case, we're interested in M-Motion. So I'm going to show you what does it come with. So the M-Motion comes with multiple. It comes with counters right at the top here. You've got uh, four counters and you've got... Uh, um, different circular style that you can get so you've got counters um, so that is eight counters and it also has tons of essentials and these essentials go basically from sets from uh, steps and uh, counting your heart rate and etc so uh, and then it has a lot of icons and this is really handy if you're for example doing a bicep so you could actually put the bicep curl in there so that's quite handy um, so if you are also interested in um, showing equipments that you're using such as cycling swimming and you could actually put certain symbols in there so that way it represents the item that you're actually using um, one thing that i found it really useful is um, if you're actually teaching somebody online uh, the work intensity is basically i've demonstrated here on the right it's basically showing that uh, it's quite intense 3.5 but if i actually um, for some people may find it really easy to do some push-up but in my opinion push-up is actually a really really uh, good way of building your chest muscles and um, so I feel like uh, it has a lot of intensity in uh, it's quite intense itself so it has um, so I've put it down as 3.5 some people may find it a lot harder they may go the all the way five itself so and then i've put down here how many sets you could actually change the sets itself um so i've put down here how many sets that i tend to do for push-ups so that would be around six sets and each set would have at least 12 reps obviously you can go a lot higher depending on to your taste so if you notice straight away these are the, the it comes with the color green so if other people are using this uh, template itself the if other people are using this plugin, then I wouldn't basically like to see exactly like for like. So I've changed some alteration in terms of the size. I've also changed the color font. So that way you can see the color itself. And I've color matched all of it. So instead of having it all green, so I've got a yellow color match in it. Uh, and then in here, repetition is what we just discussed, how many reps that you're gonna do per set. So um, that depends on you. And then we've got um, this young man here. So you can see um, on the on your screen what exactly body part that you're working on. And then you can turn it on and off, the body parts itself, the muscle group that you're working on. So again, in here, if I turn it off, literally, so by doing that, I'm turning off my abs. So you can see when you do high jump, you're actually working um, not only your quads, you're also working your abs. So I've just turned it off my abs. So if I want to turn it back on, and then I can do the, exactly the same like that. So I can just turn it back on. Right, so basically on this workout here, you can see straight away, it works your quads and also abs. You can turn it on and off exactly where you want it to show. So what I did earlier here, you had it all upper body part where you were doing an incline push-up, standing push-up or whatever you want to call it. Um, and then we also did a flat push-up, which was a flat bench more or less. Um, so this is a standing push-up, so it works your tricep as well as your chest and a bit of your shoulders. So on the next workout, I've turned it off all of the chest workout area. And now this is work is focusing on your um, quads and is also focusing on your abs. So straight away, if you want to show which body area that you want to focus on, you can turn it off and on in this area, um, as well as change the colors that you want to show it and um, the areas of that where you're working on. So this is quite handy if you want to show exactly uh, which body parts that you're working on. 
So moving on. So on this workout here, instead of me putting into how many sets or how many reps, we're going by timer. So again, the timer is quite helpful. You could put um, how many minutes that you want to interested. So for example, we've got five minutes, 10 seconds and 15 milliseconds. So we could put zero there and then zero there and then we can count, count down or you can count up. So it's totally up to you how you want to do. We also added a, a, a bit of a touch here pulse here so you it shows your heart rate how much uh, it's basically the pulse is so it's quite handy again it has all of these things um so it's all up to you what you really want to get it out of and you just need to add a bit of creativity so that way it's more unique towards what you are going for on the next workout again i've added the the back workout so you can see straight away here um you can change it from front so if you're showing the front muscle group but now we're working on um pull down so it's a lap pull so th again we've changed it from front to back um, as you can see here in the drop down and then one thing that I found really quite interesting is if you can show if you want to show it as a feminine you could actually show that as a feminine so it's not only for m uh, masculine um, guys so again this is it goes for both uh, male and female and that's quite helpful um, if you really want to uh, drill down who is it for again on the next part here i've just played about with uh, certain information here that i found it quite useful and these are the information you probably get it from your screen dial on your row machine basically going for 10k row again in here you've got um, um 70 percent of your exercise completed and then i've put down how how intense it is in this workout and in my opinion it's quite intense for five minutes if you want to go um all in so or if you want to go for um one hour exercise or whatever how long you want to go all in and then on the next workout here um, so this is just a cable jump and i found it quite useful again and i didn't have any specific icon to show the cable so i've just added a shoe in there showing how much fat percentage that we have in here so the fat percentage is eight percent and then the intensity of this workout is quite low and anyone can do this where does it actually work or what is the benefit of it it actually helps you the entire body because you've got the the jump itself it works in your abs your quads your um your every part of your body is actually working and that's why this is one of the most effective of losing fat in my opinion and then something else that you this plugin will provide you as an icon if you want to show masculine um, on the left side here and then on the right side uh, feminine and you can show that the body uh, body type of the individual finally we've got here we've got uh, basically a cycle row here again this is amazing and you can show it how intense it is and also how much time that you're using so this is a cycle row and then if i play it basically you will see it basically a cycling itself and as you're cycling yourself with the row and it's quite nice and you can see they're getting really tired so i'm just putting i'm throwing out there the heart rate and then finishing it off the weekly performance so if i show you here basically the performance is basically Friday and Sunday is the most intense. That's because you've got a gap in between um, those two days and you've got Saturday, which is a rest day. Finally, if you want to use my 10% discount, I'll leave a link in the description and also the, the code itself, which is shown right here, APTEC10. And if you want to go ahead and buy multiple uh, plugins, then you can go ahead and buy multiple plugins but please note you can't use multiple discounts at the same time so if you want to buy one plugin then i would urge you to go with my 10 percent discount till next time peace out